Welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. And it is part two of Elon Paul and his Voyager's Expedition. Uh, we're parked on the screen here. We're going to go ahead and pick up where we left off. Now, this is my live run uh, that I did yesterday. This is the run I did the night before. This is the run we're going to pick up on. Learned some new things along the way. Uh, first things first, uh, actually trying something a little different here. I'm actually wearing headphones. Um, I know that sounds weird to say. Well, you know, everybody wears headphones. Well, I don't usually. I usually just have speakers in front of me. I'm playing the audio really low, and I can hear it enough that I can get by. But I'm thinking that my microphone has been picking up on the audio of the game and is muting me or dropping my volume level down a little bit. So we're going to see what happens here. We'll see if I fade in and out. I don't know. I've got my audio turned up really kind of high right now, but we'll see what happens. So this is part two. We're going to pick up, we, we've completed all of phase one and parts of two, three, four, and five. Enough to add up to two and a half phases. And as you can see, I decided to change my appearance just a little bit. Just because I decided to goof off. And the electrical boosters. Why not, right? Alright, so let's see where we need to go here. Uh, now, if you watched my live stream yesterday, you'll know I went a little bit further than this. But one thing we learned is that we cannot record a creature... Oh boy, let's try this in English. We cannot record a creature with a blood pH under 2.5. The expedition is broken. This doesn't work. So we're going to complete as much of this as possible. So let's go ahead and progress. We're going to go to Rendezvous 2 is our next step. And... While we're in here, let me see, do we have access to installing technology? Not yet. Okay. Alright, so we're going to head out. I think our hyperdrive has got plenty of charge on it, so we're going to go ahead and keep going. So, rendezvous two. We're going to go... There... Now, if I'm not mistaken, let me just check something real quick. I don't think... Yeah, I don't have any upgrades for my hyperdrive. And we're in the first system. Um, let me check the space station real quick. As I seem to recall... Wow, okay, we're far away from the space station. Sorry about that. Probably should have just taken the teleporter at the... At the anomaly, because I think it'll be quicker. Let's find out. I got a timer going on my recording, so I'm going to see if it actually is faster or not. It said it would take a full minute to get there the other way. Ten seconds. Twenty. And of course, it parks me the furthest, literally the furthest parking space from the teleporter. That is hilarious. We'll go this way. We're at 30, 35. Now, if it would have parked us on the left, right outside the, the stupid doorway, we would have been there quicker. 40. 45. And space stations, current system. I don't know. Was it faster? Could have been. Maybe by a few seconds. By a few seconds. Pops. But that was a good experiment, I think. Not mistaken, I think they have a hyperdrive upgrade, or it's a next system. I just don't remember. Nope, all they got is a B-class. Okay, so we're going to go to the next system, which we should be able to get our upgrade from there. Do we have any upgrades we can use? Let's go ahead and get our ship upgraded. And we will go ahead and put it... I'm going to put it up here. Unbolt drive. Okay. And let's get our multi-tool upgraded. Now, this is our 
Is this our S class multi tool? No, this is a C class one. Okay. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. Um, I don't think it's here, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's at the next system. Yeah. Let's hold off on the upgrade on this because I think the next system is the system we get it at. So, it wasn't entirely a loss of time. We'll go to the next world in the system. Next next uh, place in our system here. You want Akel. Call, call. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I'm going to put some notes down here. And let's see what we get. Looks like the audio is holding up as I thought it might, but we'll see what happens here. All right, where's our space station? We're going to go there first. Ah, one of the very long entryways. So while we're landing, I'm going to check something out in our expeditions. One of these... That gives us our wonder projector. This is the one. We have to build the window projector. So once we can get this, we're in good shape. Okay. We should have money enough to get this. We do. I am going to put that down there, yes. Uh... I think we have nanites to purchase what we want. Yes, we do. 9,000 of them. Life support. Yeah. Nothing there I really want. Okay, what do we got? Hyperdrive. You're the guy I was looking for. Okay, so what do we got? That gives us a hyperdrive range of 418. That's 457. All right, good deal. And we're going to put it over here. All right. That should be good. Uh, is this the one? Nope. Definitely not. Okay. Yeah, I think we missed that one. Okay, Ancient Bones. Let's check out some of the worlds in here. Fungal planet, huh? I don't know what's going on with my scope. Or any of my screens. All my screens have gone white. That's kind of creepy. There seems to be a planet near there, but you know what? I think I'm going to warp because I don't like what's going on with my screens. So. Uh, I was going to take us straight there. Okay, so we're going to go to Rendezvous 2 now. It's almost like I was getting a glare from the rings around the planet, but no matter where I went, it didn't make a difference. Kind of strange. At least I think so. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with the audio. It's very, very odd. I'm trying things differently, but we'll see what happens. All right. Same thing with the screens. That's a paradise planet in front of us. That is... Foggy. Hold on a second. Temperate. There's another one over here. That looks like it's a cold one. 
Icebound, Frost, Aggressive Sentinels. Oh, I found a perfect planet. Most perfect. How interesting. Foggy. Okay, and that's where we're headed right now. Alright, so that foggy planet that we're heading to... Interesting. Alright, let's head there. Get to that second rendezvous and get that out of our way. Again, I don't know what's going on with the screens here. I may have to actually log out and log back in. See if we can fix that up. See what happens there. So we'll see how this goes. I want to thank all those who watched the stream on the on September 2nd. No, I'm not going to obey that space signal. Alright, let's see. DC Cloud City. Fascinating. Hey, I locked into it for once. Just instead of instead of somebody at base. All right, so we should be seeing an archive here. That looks like. Yeah, it is a minor settlement. I remember that minor minor settlement. I think our archive is near here. Because it was a long trek on foot getting there. And I couldn't believe that we couldn't see the archive from the air. There it is. All right. Yeah, we got to rendezvous too. Excellent. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I don't think this planet has the. No, it does not. I think it's the very next system we go to has what we're looking for. Okay, good. So we got that. Let's go ahead and collect our reward. Uh, that's going to give us these upgrades. Now we can upgrade up here or down here. I've been finding I need more room in my inventory. So I'm going to go ahead and grab it down there. Hmm. Looks like somebody's trying to create a sky base. It looks very odd. Very interesting. All right, so let's see what our screens look like. We got the same problem. Okay. So we are probably going to have to log out, log back in on this particular save because something just is not right. So let's go to the next system first. Okay. Looks like we can go all the way over to here. So we will go all the way over to here. Now, sooner or later, we're going to find another spaceship battle. And I've been finding that the spaceship battles are very odd. That we can make them disappear real quick. Which I'll show you when it happens again. Yep, here we go again. All we have to do is go over here, approach this ship, and gone. And I don't know why that is, but every single one of those battles I can make disappear by simply doing that. So let's go ahead and hit the space station real quick. We'll see what we got here. If we can't get the multi-tool we're looking for, we're going to go ahead and start upgrading the one we've got.
Now we do need to find us a world that has bad storms on it. And hopefully storm crystals. So that's going to be our next next idea here. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab that. How much is it? 50. I'm looking for a jetpack upgrade. Let's see what we got. Life support and thermal. We have a class movement module. I am willing to get that. Because we need something. There we go. That should give us a little bit more of a boost. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good one. It's not fantastic, but it's good. Alright, we need a hyperdrive upgrade. One more would do fine. Not going to get it here. Okay. And this is definitely not the weapon I'm looking for. It's an A-class, but I guarantee you... Yeah, yeah, four million. Not what we're looking for. So I'm not worried about it. Let's go ahead and upgrade the one we've got. Put it there. And... There's good, too, I guess. Okay. It's a C-Class, so we're not going to get any more upgrades out of it. Uh, our ship has an upgrade we can add. I forgot about that. Upgrade. Apply. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go back up here again. And we're going to fill in the top row. Okay, good deal. Yeah, there we go. All right. Let's see what kind of uh, planets we have here. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not doing this anymore. I can't handle these screens being like they are. So we're going to go ahead and land for a second. We're going to go ahead and log out, log back in. and see if our screens will clear up. reload the restore point. We'll see if that works for us. So yeah, that's kind of a weird graphic issue that's going on. I'm not sure what's causing that. So, let's see what happens here. And we'll go from there. Shouldn't take long to load up. Should only take a moment. There we go. Wait for the graphics to catch up. Jump in. Alright, that looks better. A little bit of a glare on the left side. And faded away. Okay, good. So that's better. Alright, so what do we got here? We're looking for anomalous planets too. Contoured. Let's go ahead and check it out. Because a contoured planet might be might have anomalous creatures on it. Creature, if you will. Those are always the planets that have one creature on it. Let's go with the pyrite for now. How are we doing on launch thrusters? Got plenty of uranium, we'll use it. Alright, yeah, so we're not getting the glare anymore on the screen, so that's all we had to do. Not sure if this is the planet we're looking for. Ah, maybe it is. Maybe it is. I think it is. I think this is a good one. Give it a moment. Anomalous animal. There we go. And it should be one of one. Excellent. We'll get 250 nanites for that. And that is one of our discoveries. Plus it gave me 200,000 on the uh, find as well. 
So if we go here, this is under number five, I think. Six exotic creatures. We've discovered one of six now, as you can see. So that takes care of that one. All right. Okay, very, very good. So let's go ahead and hit continue on. Very nice. So that was a good call. All right, let's check our planets out. Gamma intensive. Uh, just have regular copper there. Looks like there's another planet right there. Oh, that's the one I'm looking at. All the other planets are right here. So what do we got? Contaminated. Regular copper. We got activated copper, high temperature. Icy. Boggy. And I think that's it. So we really need to get to th this one, is it? High temperature. With the activated copper. Let's check it out. It's pretty far away, but that's okay. I'm not as worried about that. We'll land there, we'll check it out, see if we can find storm crystals. Because that's really what we're interested in on this particular phase. We need to get our storm crystals. What we could do... Let me see if they're in the catalog yet. Let's see. Ah, there we go. Pin unavailable. Okay, so we cannot pin it in order to find it. That's what I was worried about. So sometimes you can do that in order to find certain items. But in our case, we're on our own. That's the tough part. Now, to say I'm going to try to do the best I can to complete this out in the next two hours... Well, it's going to be kind of rough, but we're going to do the best we can. All right, here we go. Okay, we don't have any storms here yet. Let's get lower down, and we're going to do a little scan. There is something there. Is that just a campground? It is. Alright, I'm going to try to find some place that has a landing pad since there's no storms going on around here right now. Let's head this direction. You know what we're really looking for and I really need to be searching for? Let's slow down just a little bit. We need to find the hottest, bloodest, hottest blooded creature we can find as well. Ah, right there. That's a storm crystal on my right. All right, so we're in the right place. We just need some place to land that's safe. Got some shelters there. You know what we really need is we just need seven storm crystals, so... We don't really need shelter if we can find seven storm crystals grouped together someplace. One there. Let's just keep looking. I'm going to look very carefully here. There's group cluster right there. Alright, so this is going to be a hot planet. There we go. So this looks like we've got two, three of them here. How's our oxygen levels look? Oh, good grief, they're great. Well, those are some big guys. I don't think they're seven meters tall. 5.8 meters. Yeah, not quite big enough, right? Need a seven meter tall creature.
Looking for storm crystals. So we know that there's some right here. That's fine. Let's go the other way. Life support. There we go. I try to do that when I'm on planets. I learned that from my permadeath runs. Docile. Timid. So we're looking for hot-blooded creatures too, so that's the whole reason I'm doing this. Not a lot of storm crystals floating around in this area. So we may have to just take off in our ship and look for more. There's one down there. Or at least maybe a couple of them. We'll see. Uh, we're going to use sodium. Alright, so we've got an incoming storm. We're going to wait here by this one until the storm hits. We'll grab it. And then back to the ship. Because there's a few up there, too. Get our flying creatures, too, while we're at it. You never know. See, it's dropping like a rock now, huh? Any second. Wow, look how hot it got. 500 degrees. Good grief. Okay, let's head up. Where's the other ones at? There's one over there. Wasn't there a grouping of them right here I just saw? Okay, guess not. I don't know what... Oh, there they are. There we go. That gives us four of them. Just keep that sodium going as long as you got plenty of it. That should be five. Two hundred. Let's go ahead. Go for it. Because all we need is two more. I hate to take off with my ship. There we go. And there they are. Should be it. There it is. Okay. That should do it. And we'll get back to the ship easily on this charge. There we go. Let's go ahead and get our reward, because our reward includes our prepackaged refining unit and our wonder projector. So this is a good thing. The wonder projector is the thing we need the most. All right, good deal. Uh, what do we got? Personal refiner. Let's go ahead and put that in my uh, inventory. We'll put you over here, actually. And what else did we get? Advanced mining laser, yes, 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 we will take that. Huh, interesting. And what else we got? That should do it for now. All right, good deal. On our way. Okay, so our next thing to do is we're going to head on to... Let's see here. Yeah, I don't know why it brought us into there. We'll check that in a little bit. we got to build the Wonder Projector. So let's go ahead and do that. But we, we've already been to Rendezvous 3. Uh, Rendezvous 2. Let's head to 3 first. And then we'll come back. Oh, we never got our Vortex Cubes too. Okay. So let's go ahead and get our next step in our 
Um, where is it taking us? Good grief. Okay, over here. We'll take us to Rendezvous 3. We're going to bring in our freighter. And we'll see how we do. Now we do have to harvest plants too. 18 plants is what we need. So we're going to need some stuff too. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and hit the space station. Ah, we discovered a wonderful paradise world here. So that gave us that milestone. That is... I don't know why it keeps bringing us in there. Uh, down here. 90%. Okay, good. Excellent, excellent. And gave us this interstellar fancy, which I don't know why, but it is there. Okay. So seeing as we're not going to get rid of this starship any time soon. Huh. Oh, isn't that an interesting weapon? Eh, too bad it's no good. Uh, I don't need anything from you. Alright, let's see if we can get one more upgrade. Hyperdrive. We'll take it. Okay, this is a good thing. So now that we have this one more hyperdrive upgrade, I don't really see a need to go any further with it. Let me just see what these upgrades are. 223 and 244. We'll put you there. So now I have a hyperdrive range of 785. Okay. Alright, that should do just fine. We do need to update it. We need a warp, warp hypercore. But we do not have the recipe, so we're going to be getting that next as well. Especially now that we can get it. Um, that way we don't have to use any more um, of these guys, which we do kind of need at the moment. Okay. Let's get our update. Do we need anything up above? I think we're just going to keep going down here. Okay, what do we got? Thermal protection, life support, and radiation. Okay, we'll hold off on that. Let's go ahead and sell some stuff. Actually, I think we got some people out here by now, right? Wow. Yeah. It's not all everybody crowd in at once, huh? I'll sell to you, officer. Okay, we don't need the runaway mold anymore. I'm going to get rid of it. Uh, let's see. We definitely need the storm crystals. Uh, I don't have a reason to have dirt. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. Corvax, goodbye. Though we probably could have used that. Spool of nano cables. The nip-nip buds, definitely. Compressed indium scraps. And the recycled circuitry. Why don't we get rid of the fancy as well? Alright, we're in good shape. Um... Do we have any need from anything from you? I don't think so. Um, I'm going to grab some ionized cobalt just as a hunch. I'll grab the plutonium too because I don't know if we're going to need it or not. And the gold. Just for some reason something in the back of my mind itches and says, Hey, you might need that. So. Okay. And we will put them in our... Yeah, we have 820 over there. That's good. In our other inventory over there. Keep you. Sodium can go here. I'll hang on to you. I don't know if we're going to need you. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Let us go. Go on to Rendezvous 3. We do need to find those vortex cubes. So we do need to do a little bit of searching underground. Uh. Metallic planet. You know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking anomaly. I think. I don't recall. We're about to find out. Yeah, we do. This is going to be an anomalous planet. Okay. 
Done. Okay, that'll get us two. Launch thruster 62. All right, let's head back out. All right, free money, huh? Wouldn't that be awesome? So we're going to head to rendezvous two, three. I'll get it right. We do need to stop at the anomaly. So just shy of this, we're going to jump into the anomaly so I can grab some things, and then we're going to jump back out. We need plants. I do need frost wart. So I do have to stop at an icy planet so we can grow some things. And that way we can hopefully complete that one under this. Oh, um, that's not the planet I was looking for, apparently. It's a blood planet. That ought to be interesting. Do we have our... We have two there. Uh, let's see. Blue star, aquatic treasure. We've got a ten aquatic creatures. We need aquatic treasure. So maybe we can do that while we're here. Because this looks like a good world to do that in. We just have to get the upgrades for our... I'm not checking out your object of interest. Because only you find it interesting. I don't find it interesting at all. Okay, now if I'm not mistaken, this particular spot... ...was not an archive. It was a portal. There it is. So we have to remember to come to this place to use a portal. It's gonna get the achievement. There it is. Okay, so we're done there. So we got the third one. Let's go ahead and grab it. Alright, very good. Alright, so one of the things we need to do is we need to go to our starship and we need to put a new drive in it. Uh, we haven't gotten it yet, though, so we're going to work on that in a little bit here. Uh, let's see. Hello. Uh, creatures. Oh, that's the worm. I was wondering why I could see something 1,200 blocks away. Okay, I'm not sure what that is. Oh! He's a big guy. I want to check this out. Because if it turns out to be a creature that's very large... Doesn't seem to be. 2.5 meters. Rock. Yes, I said rock. Oh, easily angered, huh? Great. Okay. Let's see if he will attack. Yep, he will. Okay. Uh, you need to go away. Wow, they're fast runners, man. Whew, those guys were quick. Alright. Did I accidentally get something that was very large? No, I didn't. Okay, I was wondering about that. All right, so we're here. We can't finish this one. We can build our wonder projector. So let's get our freighter. 
All right, so it's here. So let's go up to space. We have to stop at the anomaly first. We've got to pick up a couple of things. We've got to do some shopping. There we go. And then we'll head back to our freighter. And then we also have to hit the space station again. So that's going to be interesting. We can use the anomaly to get to uh, our original base as well. Actually, we might do that here now and then pull our freighter in right outside the space station at that place. No, I just... I swear I wasn't trying to leave. Trying it again. And I had a great landing pl place too, did you notice that? I got one of those per perfect landing spots on the left hand side. Yeah, now it's going to land me far away, right? Yeah. It's not terrible. Of course I would mess it up, right? Huh. Wow, these Nikes I'm wearing are pretty good. I can run further and farther and faster and all that. Uh, let's see. I don't need those. I need to go over here. So first things first. Even though you already have the passes, you have to learn them again to get to your War Piper Core. So I'm going to get that. I don't need really anything over here. Uh, you'll get all these things later on, so I'll worry about that later. If I'm not mistaken... Yeah, there's nothing else to learn here. Okay, so we're good there. Um, I feel like there was something... Oh yes, of course there is. Plants. Here we go. It's not so much the plant that you need. It's this one that I need. Okay, so I've got what I need. I didn't, wasn't trying to learn the fungal cluster again, but it happens. Okay, good deal. While we're here, let's grab our exosuit upgrade for 80,000. Thank you, Bob. Uh, you're going to be the same thing, right? Yeah, not worried about it. Okay, on we go. So that should get us the things that we need to go with. So I'm going to go back to our main base. So we are in what system? Let's check real quick. The Gurubi Sako system. I can remember Sako, definitely. Okay. We need to go back to our home base. And that is here. Now you can teleport back to your freighter anytime you want. You just can't teleport from it because you don't have a teleport pad. So we're going to leave our freighter there. We can teleport back to it when we get it when we get up to the space station. Anytime now. Anytime. There we go. Okay. Okay, we don't have that anymore. That's not a problem. So on our exosuit, we're going to go over here. I need to fuel it up. Uh, we need... Actually, we need some magnetized ferrite. Where's our pure ferrite? Yeah, let's do it all. Okay. So we need to build our wonder projector, right? Which you don't think is much of anything, right? I'm going to put it right here, dead center. And if you're wondering what it does, besides give us our milestone, I'll show you. You can now select something in your select wonders display. How do you get that? You go over here and select an animal that you'd like to display. I love this guy right here, heaviest flying life form. And we're going to, if you if you look at this, if you just highlight it up here, hit Z to add to Wonders. 
and you name it. And I'm going to name this one Zane from Zane's World. Okay? And then what you can do is when you select this, you select your wonder, and you get to look at that anytime you want. Is that cool or what? I think that's the most awesomest thing ever. Anyway, so I'm going to be decorating my real bases with those. We're going to have some fun with that. All right, so what do we get for completing that expedition? We get specialized warp blueprints and some assorted planetary charts. You only need to create the indium drive. Okay, so even though we have these, and I'm going to put them in my ship, you only need to create an indium drive. So let's go ahead and do that. Indium is created with emerald and five wiring looms. We just need to do that up on our space station, which is where we're headed next. Uh, we need some frost wart, so we're going to be doing that as well. Really? You couldn't be on the landing pad right in front of you, huh? Okay, where is our space station? I should have chosen a system that had the paradise planet right next to the space station, but it is what it is. It's only going to take me 20 seconds to get there. Not a big deal. So I was going to pull my freighter in, but I'm actually going to head to the freighter instead. Now one thing I would like to get is, I know this sounds really weird, but I need more Fecium. So I'm going to see if I can grab some more. Keep those planetary charts, you're going to need them. I would really like to get some more Fecium, because that will help us build our... Uh, what do they call those agricultural units inside of our freighter? So we'll take a quick look around. Eh, there's a lot of people here, huh? A lot of NPCs. Uh, let's see. Nope, don't have it. Okay. What do we have in the system, by the way? We have any cold planets? Terraforming catastrophe. Flourishing. Elevation. Okay, that they told us the elevation was really high on this planet, so we can head over there. And windswept. Edwo. I see a par and so old planet. We think we can find frost crystals. There they are. So we'll check that planet out again. I seem to recall that I couldn't find much there. Let's check the other side before some ships arrive. Oh, we needed uh, wiring looms, right? There we go. And we only need the indium drive. There we go. So that's why you needed your emerald. And I heard a ship land. What do you have for me? Got some uranium. And I've got some pyrite. Let's go ahead and grab the pyrite, because I think we're running low on that. Okay, and that's it. Don't really need anything else. So to check things out in the expedition, Expedition 2 is completed except for this and we can't complete it. We're in Expedition 3, we're going to be heading back there in a minute. Wait, it took a while to get out of your ship there, buddy. Uh, nope, he doesn't have what we're looking for. Alright, I'm not worried about it. Let's go ahead and head back to our... freighter. right onto our freighter and let's see how much we can build we do need some uh, we do need some silver we're only going to get one run of the plants I think but we'll see as soon as it pops up 
So I'll show you first of all. See, we just appear on the bridge and drop 14 feet to the deck below and break our ankles, but that's okay. All right, so we need to build these cultivation chambers is what they're called. It requires 50 silver, 25 oxygen, and 10 fecium. We don't have a lot of fecium, okay? Just warning you in advance. So we're going to build one, two, three, four... Five, six. I would like to build one more at least, so I need more silver. Two more, really. I'd like to build one over there. Possibly build one right in the center area here. And that'll get us what we need. So we need about... Okay, so we need 70 silver and at least 20 fecium. Okay, so we'll feed some, some plants and we need some frost wart. So in this system we're in, we should, I thought we had an icy planet here. Blood, paradise, toxic. No, we don't have any icy planets. Okay, so we have a little bit of a difficult time on this one. Uh, that's not my ship. That's my ship. Hey, while they're here, what do you got for me? They only have one listing, and they won't have much. See? Pugnium. Tritium and Platinum. Doesn't really help me much. Residual Goop and Platinum. Okay, not much there. And they're all leaving now. There's one more ship it looks like over here. I don't know if we can get there in time. There we go. And gold. Okay. Well, worth a shot. Because, you know, you never know. You might get lucky. Let's go ahead and leave. On our way. Alright. So, where is our... Space station, there it is. So what I'm going to do is rather than going to the space station, I am going to warp. I need to recharge our hyperdrive, right? Yes, we do. To do that, what we need is we need... I just need three of those because we're going to do wipe, warp hypercells. Fully charged. Let's get out of here. So we're going to do like we're going on the expedition route still. We're going to go to the next system. Maybe not quite the next system, because you'll notice it doesn't take us to the next place that we need to go in the expedition. So we're just going to head over here. Actually, what does this one look like? That's a pirate system there. Huh. Is it worth going to a pirate system? There's only three planets there. Is there anything nearby that we can go to? We do need to go to a blue system and a red system. So what's the red system got for us? Lots of planets. Let's go ahead and head there. We want to get that out of the way. So there's no space station here, of course. See, visited a red star. Let's scan. Uh, fragmented planet with aggressive sentinels. What about you? What are you? That looks cold. Paradise. I was wrong completely. Hey, okay. how about you? You all have to be way the heck out there, right? Acrid. Check over here. Scarlet planet. Cadmium. What about you? Rotting planet. Fungal. This is the big planet that we just found. There's one right over here. So let's go ahead and pulse out. Check it out. And then we'll leave the system and go to a blue system if we have to. 
get away from the other planet far enough. Cadmium bladed planet. Uh, that's actually worth visiting because that should have anomalous creatures on it. I believe. Could be wrong, but let's check it out. Uh, yeah, we'll use up. See, I was running low on pyrite. I thought so. Okay. Alright, good. So we've got our red planet done. Let's go ahead and grab that expedition reward. Uh, launch thrusters, upgrade, good. Anomaly detector and portable reactor. Portable reactor, just what I always wanted. Where is my launch thrusters? There they are. We do need to upgrade our ship. Okay. There, I'll put you down there. Give you a little more room up there. Oh, that. Weird. Okay. Down we go. Fortunately, it's not aggressive sentinels. They're just... You know, agitated. And, yeah, I think this is an anomalous planet. See those little purple ones on the left? Those are collectible items. Like that. Capillary shells. They're pretty, aren't they? I'll go ahead and grab it, just because. Alright, so we should see anomalous creatures like that. And there we go. Crazy looking. See, that'll be cool to have on your base, right? We can have fun with that. Okay, so that's our third anomalous creature we got. So that became worth landing on this planet for. Alright, let's get out of here. Next system is going to be a blue star system. Looks like we got one right in front of us. Water. Is there any of them that are populated? There's one that is. That's pirate. A lot of planets here? Yes, because we're looking for an icy planet. Oh, it's a dissonant system, too. All right, that's no problem. Not that we need anything from a dissonant system, but... What we're looking for is Frostward. Okay, any time now. Alright. Oh, it has a space station too, huh? Nice. Okay, let's check out... Visited our blue stars. Yes, I know. Bubbling. That's where the dissonance is detected at. Desolate. Shell-strewn. Also dissonance. Are you kidding? That's kind of crazy. Two dissonant planets in the same system. A fiery dread world. Yeah, that sounds like a nice vacation planet. Frostbound. Okay, that's where we want to go. Um. Yeah, let's go there first. Because I really want to check out the shell strewn one, because I think we'll have more anomalous creatures there. And I know somebody out there is going to be searching system after system after system, looking for a large system that has a lot of anomalous planets so that you can discover the creatures there, or at least maybe two or three that you get to really close by. There's a lot of travel time in this one, so I don't see us ever having a speed run on this one that would take less than two, two and a half hours. If somebody figures out a way to do it. We, the only way we could do it is by eliminating some of the... Um, Sentinel Distress Signal. Alright, I'm curious. I've never had a Sentinel Distress Signal before. That's but the Intership does not attack. It's Weapon Sippenza. This is pretty cool. He's course plotted. Offer assistance. Cool. Uh, that's a new... That's a new thing. Uh, I don't. I didn't know that that existed. I, I may check that out. I don't know. We may have to do that as a little side thing. 
Okay, Nautilin Chambers is what we get on this one, so that's going to be really, really good. Good. Good, good, good. That's all the things we need in order to find one of those underwater... Uh, what's, it, what's it? What's it? So that you can discover the... Uh, stuff on. Uh, what do you call it? Get the treasure. Yeah, the treasure under, underwater. Alright, so we're looking for frost wart. Let's go ahead and get a little closer to the ground here. And we'll head in a particular direction. Let's head south. I think we just passed over something. Let me just check a little bit further along here. Ah, I see storm crystals on this planet. That's wonderful. This will make it much more difficult. Okay. There is something right there. Oh, that's a trading platform. Oh. Frost wart. Let's go ahead and grab it. Hopefully we don't destroy any in landing. Ah, uh, you know what we don't have? I just realized something. We do not have... And we're not going to get it... Hazmat gauntlets. So that's something I'm going to recommend you all get. Is you're going to need hazmat gauntlets, okay? So, before you do something like this... You have to get them from the... Anomaly. That's what I meant to get while I was there and I forgot. So, until they fix the whole thing, <laughs> that is, uh, that may be one way we can do the speed run is if we can get hazmat gauntlets right away because the fastest growing plant in the system is the frostwort, which takes an hour. And if we can make 18 plants, which I can only get, I think, 14 from what I've got right now. I can only make 14 when I get enough frost wart to do them. The maximum I can make is 14. So, that's that's something. So we have to actually buy our hazmat gauntlets. Or we can harvest nothing. Uh, right there. Uh, we don't really need anything else, so let's go ahead and get going. And that goes in our exosuit. There we go. All right. So we have hazmat gauntlets now. We can get our frost wart. We need feceum, so I should feed some animals and get some feceum as well, so I can start building something. Um, and then we need silver. And we can build a couple more of those aquatic chambers, and we should be able to get all 18 plants. 50 frost wart. For 18 plants, yeah. About 2,000 frost wars we need. Anyway. Straight down at the ground and let's not let's hope for no storms. What else does this planet have? I just realized something. Does it have silver on it? Let's check. Dioxide, which actually we could use some if we wanted to, but no, no silver. Anyway, moving along. And we're looking for the frost wart again. I know what those were. I don't need them though. Beggars. There's no landing pad here, so this must be an abandoned one. Yes, it is. Okay. And we got a storm coming in, so this ought to be fun.
It's going to make it very difficult to see in a minute. Yep, storm crystals, what do you know? Oh, there's some frost wart. Looks like a pretty decent grove of them. Watch our temperature. Oh, that's right, we do have cold protection. I forgot about that. Good. Excuse me, buddy. Actually, you know what? Let's get you guys to start pooping. Because I need the feces. Okay, any more frostwort here? Looks like it's kind of cold out here, huh? Negative 200 below, huh? Yeah, yeah, no more frost wart. Okay, we're going to hang around just a little bit and get our feceum going. How much do we get of the frost wart? There it is, 255. And to build, to make these plants, though, it requires, I think, 50? Let me check real quick. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Plants, plants, plants. Plants. Frost crystals. Okay, well, we could just do that, and it's going to discover it for us. Oh, right over there. Okay. Oh, any, anybody pooping yet? How's it get some some of that? No, nobody pooping, huh? Let me just check, because I would have thought we'd seen poop by now. I was hoping to get some feces out of these guys, unless it's already frozen. <laughs> yep. This is so much fun. Waiting around for animals to poop. Oh, well, that's nice. Now the poop won't be so frozen. Anybody? What? All of you were born without butts or something? What, what's going on here? Yeah, 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 I know. I don't think any of these creatures are going to actually do anything. I can't believe this. Alright, well, that's going to be a problem because we need more. Ah. No, nobody wanted to poop. Well, well, well. You people stink. Literally. I'm going to go ahead and collect this since we can collect that now. Let's get our frost wart, shall we? Since we're not really hurting for launch fuel, I'm going to go ahead and take off. 
and land over there. Ah, this looks like a nice, a nice one too. Okay, good. This will be enough. Good, 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 good. that one. Come over here. Let's grab this one. This one. This one. This one. Alright. Any more? Is that all of them? I think that's all of them. So how much do we have? 700. That's a pretty good amount. I think that'll get us what we need. Yeah, I think we're good. Just disappointed that we couldn't get any poop out of these guys. And I kind of need that, you know? Alright, off we go. Alright, so where's our planets at? So we were going to check out one of the other weird ones. Desolate. Uh, Fiery Dread World... Shell strewn is, I think, where we're gonna go. Uh, what were you? Magma. Magma. Funny word. Bubbling. Dissonance detected. Hold on. Dissonance detected. And three dissonant worlds in the same system. What in the world? I've never seen anything like that. I mean, my system that I'm at in Eisentum has three paradise planets, but I've never seen three dissident worlds in the same same system. That's really, really odd. So, in case you're wondering about the system, that is the system. Discoveries. Discoveries. I'll get there in a minute. At Gemini. Gemini's system, it looks like. Fascinating. Okay. So, if there's any animals here, we'll try to get some stuff out of them, but I got a funny feeling there aren't going to be. If it's a dissonant planet, the shell strewn planet may not have any, uh, anything special about it. There we go. A little less wobbling around there. No toxic atmosphere detected in current system. I don't think it's going to work, my friend. I really don't think it's going to work. So let's hit this, and we'll head back to the space station. I'm trying to get, to get, ourse get ourselves some silver. I want to develop two more... units. Of course, we haven't found the... What's the other thing that we found here? The distressed interceptor. We may have to do that. It looks like it's got a storm going on of some sort, maybe. Just a heavy cloud system. There's that purple tinge you get on these dissonant planets. Oh, that's a really weird system. Oh yeah, this is anomalous. There we go again. We've discovered another one. Okay, so if it, as far as the expedition's concerned, we've discovered four exotic creatures now. Fascinating. Okay, good deal. Alright, so and what are the plants here just out of cure? Hexaberries? Yeah, that doesn't surprise me at all. And we never did find our... Okay, I know the name of this. Humming sack. Wait a second. That is a... 
underground cave. I'm wondering if we have... Uh, I don't know. We need to find the vortex cubes is the reason why I'm, I'm doing this. Because we have a cave here. And I just don't know if we're going to find them. Capillary shell again. Okay. I'm trying to decide whether it's worth our time. And since vortex cubes are not um, craftable, finding them is a pain in the neck. So you have to find a, a, a system that has caves on it and then, you know, look. It's just that simple. All right, let's, one thing at a time. We're getting distracted by multiple different things. We will get that when we get that. All right, let's get out of here. And our space station is there. So as we do the space station, we're going to check to see if we can get some silver. I only need, you know, like I said, about 70 more. I need feceum. I need to get animals that have feceum so I can actually create everything else I need. I need two more of those areas. I don't know if I'll find anybody that's carrying it, but... I'll have to keep that in the back of my mind. When we do, if we do speed runs, we'll see what happens. Okay. I don't think we've been to this particular space station yet, so. Let's see what we got. Nope. Nothing I need. Do we have anything to sell? No, but we do have some upgrades we can do. As we wait for ships to pop in. And we'll check out the pilots. The pilots usually have some oddball stuff on occasion, so. It's not what I was trying to do. Uh, I'm going to go start upgrading over here. I think we only need the one more spot in our inventory here. Yes. All right, we got ships landing. And of course we got to look. Nope, not worth our time. All right, ships be landing. Let's start with you. We need silver, and we need BCM. Gold. Uranium. And that ship's already left. Well, oh, solar ship. Cool. Uh, silver. Yeah, I'll just take it all. What the heck. Yeah, even no BCM. A-class. Nice. I don't like the sails. But nice ship nonetheless. Alright, looks like we got another ship over here that landed. Pilot is missing. There he is. Nope. I don't think we're going to get Fecium. It's a shame. We just need it. No feceum, nothing. I checked the back room, but usually there's nothing like that back here. We'll take a look. Nope. Ugh.
I wasn't trying to sit down. You know I wasn't. Is this a different ship? I think it might be. So we are going to have to land on a planet to get some Fecium. I'll check the hauler just in case, but I got a funny feeling that's not going to be it. Nope. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to head on to number four. Let's take a look. Okay. Hostility quotient we still have to do. In the vortex cues. Let's see what we can do about completing this. I'm going to go to another system, maybe in the line of our path. And the next system we go to... Because now we don't need to go to any other star systems here. Let's go just... Uh, I mean, we can go further if we want. we got a really long system here. Yeah, let's go here. Let's see what we got. We'll take the longer jumps. We have to discover a hostile world. I don't know if we have to land on it. That's the thing. I think we just have to appear in a system that happens to have it. So. Hey, battle. Let's see if it works again. So it's worked twice in a row now. Let's see if it works this time. Gone. So that was the end of that. I really seriously think that most likely there is a problem. And they're going to fix that glitch. So do it now while you can. Let me go to here and choose a different one. Okay. 84%. Okay, and you can scan the worlds to get what you're looking for. Okay, good to know. Nope, no Fecium. Gonna worry about upgrades. We're gonna go check out the other terminal just to see. PCM is a purchasable item, otherwise, we're gonna have to land on a planet. Hmm. Phosphorus, okay. Nope. There's my ship. Like any of the ships decided to land here today. I'm not waiting around. We've already gone almost an hour and a half, and we still haven't done our main objective. What are you? Verdant. Let's go ahead and land real quick. You know what? We should land near the water. why I didn't think of this before. Okay, that should be good. Nothing there. That's alright. This is close enough. Oh, nice looking planet, actually. I'm in a Like I said, we need Fecium, so let's see what happens here. And we're going to scan the creatures while we're here. We just scan all the creatures at once.
that's really weird. Now, I just need all of you to start uh, defecating on the ground here. Come on. Just need a little bit more. And I don't want to shoot that plant until after, uh, after all you guys have, uh, you know, pooped all your contents out. <laughs> I eat his feceum. So you eat the feceum? I really don't need that right now, okay? Honestly. Really? Nothing? Nothing. Not one of you are going to poop for me. Unbelievable. What's about this big guy over here? Really is a pretty world, isn't it? Figure this guy would have, you know. Let's see what we got out of this guy. Okay. Really? Come on, guys. Give me a break here. Seriously, nothing. Okay, so apparently we can't get these animals to poop at all. And he's gone to a question mark, so he's beyond the point at which he would normally have pooped. Oh, this is incredible. Try one more. And see if it works. I don't know if it'll work or not. How many creatures have we discovered on this planet already? Seven of the thirteen. Well, this is the most boringest part of this, is the waiting for something to poop. We have a little bit of ECM left. I guess I could glitch some. That really doesn't sound fair to me that I have to actually do it that way. Kind of sucks. Yep, see, that's the, that's the noise right there. That's what they usually do. And then they scratch their back legs or, you know, they kick their back legs out to indicate they're burying it. Unbelievable. Not getting it, huh? To say the least, I'm disappointed.
Nope. Okay. So, we're done here. Apparently this planet that we thought would be a good place to do it on is not working at all. Alright, let's uh, head to the water. We do have caves here, so let's check underground real quick. There was subterranean relics just there a second ago, and they disappeared. How is that possible? That's annoying. There it is. Let's see how many we got. One, two, three. We got three of them. And that's it. All right. Let's just go to another area, because that's the other thing we need. We know how to get our vortex cubes while we're here. Very nice looking planet, to be honest with you. I kind of really like this place. Sometimes they have Fecium. Okay. And we have a trader dropping in. What do you got for me, my friend? I don't know. Is there anything I really want? I'll check that out. What the heck? I got so many nanites now, it's ridiculous. Sure. That's fine. I don't really see a need to sell anything else to you or buy anything. Looking for one more cave. And now's the time I would have been great to try to get my uh, 8,000 units walked. But. Is what it is. One of these days I'm going to do a permadeath run and they're going to stick me on a paradise planet. I don't think that's true, but it would be hilarious. All right, I think we're going to go into water. Heading back this way, because this is where the biggest bodies of water were. Interesting looking creatures. There we go. That's where I was looking for.
We may need some supplies from our ship, so we're gonna go ahead and get our Nautilon chamber going. We need five metal plates, a hundred salt, and four crystal sulfides. Let's get our crystal sulfides, shall we? Go the water real quick and take a look. That's the plant I'm looking for, I think. Nope. One of these plants has got to have some salt. How about you? Nope. Might as well look at the creatures, too, while we're under here. Oh, I know what they are. They're these big guys. Yeah, that's it. And we'll probably get attacked. We need a hundred salt. Fifty-four. We need one more. That's a different one. Oh. Okay, that one. How much salt do we get? Oh, we got it all. Okay, good. Alright, so we need our crystal sulfides, which I'm sorry we sold now. Of course, we're not going to find any here now. But I've also noticed that the crystal sulfides, you don't see those plants until you're right on top of them anymore with your scanner. And I think we're going to need pearls, too. I don't know why, but something tells me we're going to need those for the upgrades. So we're going to head down and get those. Oxygen. Actually, we don't have to. Now that I think about it. There we go. Amazing that you need these crystal sulfides, but you can't find them when you need them. When you don't need them, they're all over the freaking place. Is that the ones I opened? Yeah. There's one. Oh, 
All right. Let's get up here. All right, so we're good. No idea where my ship is. There it is. Okay, that's all right. We don't really need to worry about it. Okay, so how much do we need? We need five metal plates. We should have plenty of ferrite dust. Yes, we do. I don't know why I did that. There we go. Make our Nautilin chamber. Okay, Nautilin chamber made. So our exocraft, we can now upgrade it. We can make a hydrothermal fuel cell. I gotta find it first. Oh, wait a minute. Did we get an achievement for that? Let me just see something here real quick. Navigation data emerald, forbidden exosuit. Okay. Construction plans. Good. Okay, well. There's nothing in here that says we can't create these things. We need a hydrothermal fuel cell, and we don't know how to make those. Or do we? And I'm just missing it here. Just making sure I'm not looking straight at it. No, I don't see it in there. Okay, well, let me get some stuff to put in here first. Paralysis mortar. That's nice. Or Piper Drive. I can't put that in there yet. Okay. We're doing okay over here. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Are we actually literally going to have to go up and learn this? Do we get it from any other part of the expedition? That's going to be kind of ridiculous. No. Hyperdrive. Auto launcher. Things to make food. Craftable components. That might be it. We need more vortex cubes. Okay. So let's do this. Just make a quick right. We're going to go straight onto the land mass here. And we're going to look for... A cave system of some sort. This looks like it might be a good place to stop. Launch thrusters should be fine, and we'll look down and see if we can't find something. We need three more vortex cubes to get what we're looking for. Okay, it's good that that's over there. Unbelievable. And I noticed there's been no storms either, so which is very, very interesting. Oh, wait a minute. Sentient plant, never mind. That's the right icon, it's the wrong color. Twelve of the thirteen creatures, go figure, huh? I'm not even really trying, and that's the sad part. 
We don't want to bother the sentient plants. Sentient, if you will. Because... They will attract... Sentinels. And we don't really need that right now. Yep. There we go. Oh, do I just go off to one side. So you don't accidentally break them. Looks like we just have just enough. There we go. Okay, let's see if this gives us what we're looking for. Okay, craftable components. What are those craftable components, my friend? Doesn't look like it's anything I can use. I don't think I can create that. Nope. So we are going to have to go up to the space station. All right. Unbelievable. We have to go up to the anomaly and actually get this, which I think is absolutely ridiculous. Let me, again, let's check one more time. Maybe we're missing something. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. We got all these, and none of these gave it to us, right? Even in number four, which is where you're supposed to be able to do it. Emerald? No. See? I already got those. Black hole? Nope. Gold nugget, underwater construction plants. Nothing. And in phase five, you shouldn't have to go all the way here to get it. See? And I haven't learned all the Corvax words yet. Really? Okay, well, that's kind of weird. Okay, and none of those are giving it to us either, so there's literally, there's no... Unbelievable. A little disappointed. Come on, Hello Games. You tell us to go do something, and you don't give us the ability to do it. Unless... I'm going to go ahead and do this anyway, because we're out here. Unless you don't really need to drive the ship. All you need to do is scan. And I think you get the ability to build the scanner. Huh. That's very interesting. Again, we'll grab it while we're here. Really don't know why it always chooses these outside areas. So you have to run the furthest to get there. But whatever. Very, very interesting. I don't know if it's here at the Exocraft guy. I don't recall if it's here or the other one. Hmm. No, it is not. And I thought we had... Radar. I could have swore we had that already. Okay, we'll get that, but we can't get the Humboldt Drive stuff. So that's here. Unbelievable. So the one thing we really needed, we didn't get. Nor did we get the radar, either. And I could swear I, I got something like that. But pretty certain I didn't sell it. Crap, I wonder if I did sell it by accident in one of the... I don't know. After a while, it all kind of blurs together. All right. Let's go straight down to our Nautilin. I think it's straight below us, but I don't know. Okay. 
Okay. And it looks like there's a storm going on. So I can't see. So we'll head down to the what we think is the ocean. And we'll just build it anew. Except we didn't unbuild it. Ah, I am just getting so upset here. And we can't see it from here because we're too far away. Oh, I'd love to, but you got to tell us where it is. Oh my gosh. So this is basically one of those episodes where I literally, since I'm not live, I can't rant to anybody about this. Okay. Let's head back to the planet. I'm assuming it's right here in this general area. So let's just drop straight down. And we'll check our radar. This looks like it could be the area, but... So, me thinks I'm going to have to end up doing this all over again. We're going to have to do it all over again. Okay. Great. Yep, I'm going to keep quiet for a moment while I digest the fact that I had basically wasted all my time doing this. Fortunately, we should still have enough of these on our person. We only needed four. I've got two. Let me put all of our upgrades in the other one. We need it. Going through tons of this stuff. Yeah, it is underwater. Okay. 
We need more salt, and we need cytophosphate in order to create that. But before we do that, let's do this. We need two more crystal sulfites and a solar mirror. Can we make a solar mirror right now? Of course not. We get all three while you're here. All right. It's been a while since you probably heard me this upset. And it is what it is. Okay. Let's fix this. And before we even do that, let's see what we can do about scanning or sunken buildings or submerged ruins. Okay, so there it is. We still have it highlighted. We do. Now we just have to go there by ship. So here we are, two hours into this one. Yeah, I knew that was there. Didn't care. And you do need a, 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 what do you call it, a pearl for this, by the way, folks. Don't forget to get a pearl. You need at least one. All right. Looks like I'm not going to find land closer than this, so... So we're just going to swim the old-fashioned way to get there. I don't care at this point. Could have taken the submerged submersible with us, but this will be the old fashioned way of getting there, and you can suffer with me. And before we dive all the way down, we're going to go ahead and go back up to the surface. As long as you're underwater, your your water jets are a lot more efficient. I have a funny feeling you'll be able to do a lot of these from... here from the first worlds that you get to in that first system okay 
Let's just recharge, and then we'll go down. Okay, down we go. Okay, we got our ancient key. Use your radar. Look for one of the sealed chests. Train manipulator. And you'll see to get the sealed chest open, you need the pearl and the key that you just got. Okay. And there we go. Treasure from the deep. Completed. Okay, let's get up and out of the depths here. We are pretty darn deep. Guess what? That was the last creature of this place. Alright, there's our ship. Is there any land nearby that's closer? Because that's pretty far out. That one might be closer. Pretty sure it is, actually. Okay. Recharge. Slow going. Yes, this has been fun. Eventually, we'll complete this. This looks like it's about the longest part of this whole thing. We still have, don't have our feceum. We haven't planted our plants. So what we're going to do is we're going to plant the plants and just get them going. And we'll complete out the rest of our expedition. And what we'll probably do is we'll probably, once they have the uh, other part of the mission completed, we'll come back and do a supplemental part. Indicating that, you know, to show the completion of the last two stages. Supplemental video. Okay, anytime now. Yeah, Nautilin Chamber, I just should have brought it with me, and I wasn't about to build another one. And while we wait, let's get our reward. Yeah, won't be doing that anytime soon. Okay. So what do we got? More stuff. So there's the uh, crystalline eggs that we can sell if we want. And our vortex cubes. So, what do we got left? Hostility. Yeah, why not? Might as well use those and get rid of them. Alright. So let's look for a system that has a really nasty group of worlds to it as we head on our expedition route. Let's see if it happens to be in this fourth area. Let's see what we can get. So I guess this is going to be the longer of the two episodes. Scan our worlds. First one. Okay. You. That's a paradise planet, so I doubt there's going to be hostility there. 
Come back around, you. Bountiful. Alright. Any other planets over here? I don't think there are. Let's drop down over here. Aggressive, huh? Well, let's see where our route will take us. Because this is our fourth rendezvous point, so we might as well hit it. Takes us over here. To the rainy planet. Alright, so let's head over there and check it out. And while we're heading there... We'll come back to here and look. Let's see if there's any hostile planets here. Nope. We haven't found any, so we're going to have to do some system jumping in order to find it. I don't know why it keeps going into planetary records for some reason. Uh, it's taking us to the supply base instead. So, tell you what. Let's go ahead and land anyway. Is that? It is. You'll have a landing pad for me. Animals, animals, animals. Looking for animals. We got birds. Great. Eight species, so I'm assuming there's some ground based ones. These guys, I know they like to poop, so let's see what happens. Alright, let's see what happens. Interesting, they look like bears with uh, sleeping masks. I don't like bears with sleeping masks. Fascinating. Maybe they're battle masks. Yeah. That sounds pretty cool. Now, if they'd only just, uh, you know. Directing bowels. Hey, I heard something. Did I hear what I think I heard? No? Are you kidding me? So we can't get animals to poop. Oh man, this is that's just annoying. Okay, you you've 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 ticked me off for the last time. Where's the feces map? On board my freighter, isn't it? Let's see. Nope, it's not there either. Let's check for it. Hold on. I know I'm probably seeing it not. Am I not? Am I looking right at it and not seeing it? What's going on here? This is ridiculous. Starship, do you have it on you? I think we used up all the Fecium, didn't we? Oh, 
Okay. Time to whisk out some help. We can use Mordite to get Faceo. But we'll have to do something special. Sorry, we gotta do this, guys. Twenty two Mordite. So what we got to do is we're going to get rid of you. It's not letting me do it. Why is it not letting me? Oh, because there's stuff inside. We need two magnetic resonators and three quantum computers. Yeah, this is getting a little bit ridiculous. We need more ferrite dust. quantum computers. She needs three more antimatter and three microprocessors. And I don't have enough chromatic metal for it. Yeah. It's turning into a fiasco at this point, folks. Copper at 500. So you can see that this is turning into something absolutely abominable and ridiculous to get things done. We do have some emerald on us. We could have used that. Yeah, we do have some emerald. We could have used that. I just realized that. I'm going to get about 100 of this. Just to play it safe. go into the large adjustment that way we get a little bit more a lot quicker that should be good wow 
I never really thought that this would turn out to be such a fiasco to get this one done. There we go. Let's grab that copper. Let it go. Okay. We need microprocessors. Three carbon nanotubes, and we need more of the chromatic metal. Oh my god, you are got to be kidding me. Metal for days, folks. There we go. Okay. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take some carbon and we're going to produce that much fecium. We don't need a lot of it, so this should be all we need. So I think what's going to end up happening here is we're going to call it here very soon because I don't think we really need to do anything more. Yeah, I think we're going to be calling it here very, very soon. So we have the feces we need. We, have, we don't have the silver we need. We need silver. So let's go ahead and take off. Let's head to the space station. Space station's over here. Shouldn't be too far. 30 seconds away. And then we'll head to the rendezvous. But I think we're going to have to call it here because we're going on 2 hours and 20 minutes and we're still nowhere near it. What a frustrating portion of this. Um, hopefully the live version goes a little better. is we'll pull in our freighter and get our plants going and then we can complete out the expedition after that. Processors, huh? I'll go ahead and grab that too, since we could use it. No silver. I get the feeling that silver, the only place we're going to get it, is going to be in the uh, asteroid fields.
Why not? Because we can always use that, right? As it seems, I could use a lot more stuff than I ever thought. Paraffinium. Lots of people have gold, uranium, pyrite. Nobody has silver. Nope. No silver. Okay. Do any of these planets have silver on them? This one does. The Bountiful Planet. And the Rainy Planet, which is the one we think we have to go to. So let's head over there. Is that the planet? Yeah, it's the rainy planet. So we'll hit rendezvous four. We're going to look for silver. We'll pull, pull in our freighter. Let's see what we got. So as we get here, we'll pull in the freighter. Like I said, we're going to see if we can't redo two more units. We'll use our frost plants to produce new plants. And uh, we'll make note of all this and make sure that this never happens again. And I'd love to say, let's never talk about this again, but the recording is there for every for everybody to see. Yay. Oh, good. There's a storm going on right now, so I can't see anything, or... Communication beacon. Hold on a second. Where are we going? Is it over here? Lots of communication beacons. Um, why are you telling me it's not clear? There's a lot of communication beacons here, so... Well, this is the fourth rendezvous. What do you know? Okay, good. Let's look for silver. Silver deposit, 278. I'll take it. It's close enough for me. We already got a terrain manipulator going. Let's charge it while we're here. We need, like I said, about 70. If we need any more, I'm going to glitch it. I don't care at this point. Why does it say silicate powder? Because it's a very poor deposit, that's why. Okay, looks like we got about 100 silver. Let's see. We have 600 silver? Okay, I'll take it. It didn't look like we gathered 600 silver, but whatever. Okay, let's bring it in. Okay. So we've gotten our fourth, I don't know why it ends up there every time, expedition. 
Let's get our upgrades. Get some more nanites out of it, of course, that we don't need. Okay. Plants, cultivation chamber right in the middle. So we need one more chamber, which we're going to put right there. Okay, now we're going to do frost wart. Okay, now we got one, two, we need dioxide. So three, glad I got some. Four, five, six, seven. Eight. We can do six more. That'll give us 14. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and that's it. Is that all of them? Okay, so we're out of frost crystals. Don't think we can put down our... We can put down a portable refiner. Can we build a second one? Because by gum, we're going to do this. So in case you've never done this before. Yep, didn't work that time. Let's do it again be funny if they disabled it for this. Where's my frost wart? Frost crystal. Forty two. See? Do it one more time. Should give us enough plants. Well, that's 80, 84. I am going to do it one more time because I think I need a couple more plants. I don't know how much dioxide we have. We have enough. Let's go ahead and plant our plants. Okay. How many plants is that? Let's let's count them all, shall we? So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. We need one more set of plants. So I'm gonna get rid of that chamber there. And we're gonna build a new one. And uh, what are we short on? Short on frost crystal still. So one more time. So yeah, if I had I gotten more frost crystals, we'd be in better shape. I only need to do this once, I think. Good. Let's see. Can we build one more plant? Nope. We gotta do it again. Hate to do that. There we go. Okay. Looks like we got our plant. And that's all of them. So that's 18 plants. And we're set there. So next time we come back, they'll be ready to go. Uh, what else we got to do? So phase one is done. Phase two, we can't complete. Phase three, we still have to f discover a hostile world. We have to harvest these plants and discover a creature with body temperature over 140. So we got a lot more scanning to do. 
We also have to use a portal and enter a black hole, so that shouldn't be too hard to do. We know there's a portal at phase three, so we can do that. And then phase five, we have to discover six exotic creatures. We got two more to go. A very tall creature. We got to learn some more Corvax words. I'm going to reach our final rendezvous. I think we can get this done. Depending upon how these go, these two over here go, we should be able to get this completed in an hour. So we'll see how it goes. So I'm going to go ahead and call it quits here, folks. I want to thank you all for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. I know this was kind of a jinky episode, but I appreciate you sticking with it. Thank you very much. We'll see you again in the future. Take care, everybody.